welcome to aditya university i am dr s ramasri pro vice chancellor academics of aditya university i would like to give you the features of the curriculum that is being developed for aditya university students the curriculum is designed in line with nep 2020 following the UGC and AICT norms. Here, our interest is to deliver not only a theoretical knowledge, but also practical exposure to the students. And that is the reason majority of our courses, nearly 80% of the courses are integrated courses, wherein we have equal weightage for practicals along with the theory. And we also offer a flexibility to the students, wherein students can opt the courses through the choice-based credit system. And apart from the core courses, equal importance is also given to the multidisciplinary courses, value-added courses, skill enhancement courses also as part of the curriculum. The overall idea is to develop the personality, the overall personality of the students so that they are eligible and they can opt any career in their future. And as a part of this, a student-based learning concept is also introduced so that students participate in all the curricular activities, extracurricular activities, uh, the outreach activities, hackathons, ideathons, etc. So the students' learning is also enhanced using the Coursera platform, the LinkedIn platform also. As you know, nowadays the online platforms gain importance so that the student choose their learning paths and become eligible for the roles that are being published. Along with the coursework, the students are also offered some industry partnered certification programs and to highlight, BTEC CSE is offered in collaboration with SAP, BTEC AML is offered in collaboration with Microsoft, BTEC CSC program, BTEC AML program, BTEC DS program are offered in collaboration with Google Cloud. As a part of these collaborations, students are made to learn certain courses and get certifications in the concerned courses. So for example, as part of uh, SAP course, the ABAP programming, the SANA, the Fiori, all these certifications would be covered by the student so that he is eligible for the placements right in their final year itself. As part of Microsoft, students are also going to complete seven different certifications, the Microsoft Azure platform, the Microsoft EI cloud platform and so on. And similarly, when we go for the BTIC uh, CSC or AI or DS in collaboration with Google Cloud, uh, students are also able to complete certifications, seven different certifications on cybersecurity, data analytics, AI cloud, etc. And out of these certifications, students will become more eligible for the placements. And as part of these collaborations, uh, students will also gain experience of what is being carried out in the industry from the industry experts and they will also have an opportunity to get the paid internships right in their uh, second year or third year also. As part of the curriculum, internships are mandatory wherein two different summer internships and a full semester internship is part of the curriculum. Students have to complete summer internship during their summer program after the second year and the second one after the third year for two months and in the final semester student has to complete a six months internship program and as a part of this summer internship for the students who couldn't get an opportunity to do the internship outside and to enable the students to have an experiential learning we have offered internship in the campus giving them certain problem statements related to interdisciplinary work or a research work and here we have nearly 49 teams who have participated in the in-house internships have completed uh, 49 different projects wherein we will also be publishing few of them as papers nearly 20 of them are expected to be published within the next uh, six months and we have nearly 238 interns who have completed the internship program in the last summer. I would like to take you 
to the project expo that is being conducted as part of the outcome of this uh, in-house internship program. So please join me in looking at the project expo. These are all the projects that are being developed by our students. This is how they are going to convert the knowledge that they have gained in the classes and converted them into useful products, maybe useful for the university or for the society. We are also planning to host the Project Expo 2.0 very shortly and wish to see you all at Aditya University. Thank you.